<laughs> There's dozens of us. Indeed, Robard. Sigismund of Luxembourg has a rare talent for winning people over to his cause. You may be in for a surprise. I don't think he will set his heathen dogs on us today. Greetings, Lord of Tomberg. <laughs> That's the bastard who let the attack of Scullis and kill my parents. An idiot! Do you want to end up like them? I am Sir Mark Bart von Aulitz. I come in the name of Sigismund of Luxembourg, King of Hungary and Croatia, who has resolved to strike against those who disrupt Concord in the land and to restore order in the name of his brother, King Wenceslaus IV. Restore order by burning and pillaging the king's estates. Greetings, Sir Markvart. The efforts of the king's brother to bring order to this chaotic <laughs> land are what undoubtedly noble. It seems to me, though, that he and his army have somewhat strayed. As Burgrave of Prague Castle, I am entirely beholden to the king. And here in Townburg, divine peace reigned until your arrival. To what then <laughs> For do real? you hold the honor of your visit? Yesterday, His Majesty took action against the enemy of the kingdom, the Ratzig Kobila, who has been using the silver from the Skalitz mine to fund insurrection against the crown. Ooh. Unfortunately, the insurgent escaped. Would you happen to know, noble sir, where he might be at this time? As far as I know, the Sir Radzik of which you speak is the king's hetman at Skalitz. I find it hard to imagine that he would rebel against our king. Nevertheless, I can assure you that Sir Radzik is not at Talberg. He would be a fool indeed to flee from one castle, where he has little chance of defense, to another, where he has even less. Or do you take the view that my humble manner is any obstacle to your army? Am I to inform the king then? That Zeratsi Kobila is not a Tamburg, and that he has your loyalty. Sir Radzig Kobila is not here, and I have no intentions of getting embroiled in affairs from which I have nothing to gain. Very well, sir. As you wish. I will relay your words to the king in the hope he will be as hey, well. Hey, Dilton. Thank you, buddy. You I appreciate the sub. Those who have clean consciences and goodwill may find themselves well disposed even at moments like this, when there is little cause for joy. Farewell, sir. Auf Wiedersehen. Tense. Oof. Yeah, for real, burn it down. Back to the horse running simulator. My lord, you have my utmost permission. Get on with you, Robard. My lord, for real, you're the goat on God. Something tells me I'm going to fight that guy later. Talk to Sir Rubard, get a horse, bury your loved ones, and... God be with you. Is 
Mr. Robard, I need to get to Scallitz. What would you do there, lad? Sigismund might have left, but the place will be swamped with robber barons, brigands, deserters, and other vermin. And anyway, your lord commanded you to stay here. Sir Robard, my parents died there. I can't leave them to be eaten by dogs. What would you do in my place? Sorry, lad, but I won't take orders. You'll have to wait until everything settles down and maybe your lord will change his mind. What's up, shady guy? God be with you. Can you tell me who I can buy something from or sell to? You want Votem, the fellow that fixes the weir at the Tomberg fish pond. He should be around the granary somewhere. God be with you. Jesus Christ be praised. I need to get out of here. And I need a feather bed with a comely wench in it. But it looks like we'll both be disappointed. Sir Divish gave orders not to open the gate, and you especially are not to be let out. My mother and father were left in scallops like carrion. I have to bury them. I can't leave them to the dogs. I'm sorry, my friend, but I can't. You'll have to persuade Sir Robard, or think something up so I don't end up in a shipwreck. Otherwise, forget it. All right, we'll see what I can do. All right. May the Lord watch over you. That's why you pick speech in the beginning, boys. You'll have to wait for me here, friend. Better to keep going on my own. On a scale of 1 to 10, how well you guys think this is going to go for him? I bet the smell is awful. I get fucking wrecked. Uh, mercy kill. All right. Now we're cooking. Forgive me. Forgive me for everything. Let 
next time I won't run. I'll never run away again. I'll find the one who did this to you. I remember his face. I'll find him. First, I have to find the shovel and, and take care of you. I remember you told me you wanted to lie beside Mother. Here, under the linden tree. At least I can do that much for you. <laughs> oh shit. <laughs>